going hopping, hop, we're going hopping today when things are popping, hop, up to the Delphi way, we're going to drop and drop on all the music they play on the bandstand, bandstand. Man is stripping for action already. Look at this, he's taking his clothes off. This is Richard Dennis Peter, is that right? Peter, let me ask you, if you will, please, to introduce me to the lady and the rest of the gentlemen. This is Kate Humble, back in vocals. Hello, Kate, nice to see you, over here. John Gosling on keyboards. Thank you, John, for joining us. You better stand up, sir. Nobody will be able to see you. Yes. This is Tony Beard on drums. Tony, thank you very much. Uh, bass player, please. Our bass player is Graham Edwards. And all the way back with the, uh, the dark shades on over there. We've got to get a little light on this man. There he is. Guitar and saxophone, Alan Murphy. And your associate, Richard Drummy. Now, how long ago did you two get together? Uh, we've been friends for about 10 years. We've been writing for about four years now. Did the music always sound like what we just heard? No. <laughs> What was it originally? Uh, well, we've always been influenced by American music, and I think that uh, the album sounds the way it does more because of our relationship with our producer, really. Well, whether you're an American uh, from Minneapolis or from New York or an Englishman from any part of, of uh, your world, you've got to get money to do what you do. Did you play bars and, and all of that stuff? Or how did you get financing to do what you uh, do? Well, we just started writing together and a friend came around and said, look, you know, this is a good song. You should try and get a publishing deal. And he put us in contact with uh, a publishing company and that's how we managed to do all our demos. To try now, they give you money. Yes. In return, what do they take? Uh, well, they expect you to write 12 songs a year. Didn't actually quite manage to no, do that. No. But, uh, but so right. you're like an employee of the publishing company. More or less, yes, yes. Uh, is that forever or to a limited length of time? Yeah, it's a limited length of time, but we're, we're very happy with the company. I mean, they saved our lives, really. Well, that's, it's one of the things a lot of people don't understand when they start out, how you keep uh, from starving to death. Now, as you made the demos, and people take them and say, we'll get back to you, do you go out of your mind waiting for the answer? Uh, well, yeah, we, yeah, things were looking pretty bleak, yeah. you know, after about two years with the publishing company. Uh, obviously, they'd invested a lot of money in, in us, and uh, we didn't seem to be able to interest the company. At well, that. now it's all paid off. You don't have to worry. We were talking about touring. When will you back, be back in the States? We'll be back in about six weeks' time, and we'll be touring the States for about two and a half months, so we should get to see everybody. All right. Now, you won't go to Catalina. You should for <laughs> vacation. It's a lovely little spot, a gorgeous little island, 26 miles away. What will we hear next, please? This is Call Me. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, go west. <laughs> 